Hey, here's the second video. I couldn't be more in a minute. But anyway, uh, what I've talked about is the guard on here. Like the oil splash guard on the old one, you could just sit there and spin that thing. Of course, this one's right. I done replaced it. But uh, I was worried about it rubbing this housing here and ruining it, but it didn't hurt it. So I got lucky on that. And then I just went ahead and I replaced that whole yoke and that U-joint and got different straps on it now. But I uh, went ahead and did all that. And I just kind of, I think it's pretty close. I just kind of kept tightening it down until it got close. My pinion nut there had about two threads sticking out. Of course, kind of hard to see in the video, but it had about two threads sticking out. So I just kept tightening it down until I got about one thread out. And then I took it, you know, pushed it side to side and pulled it forward and back and just kept tightening until it felt like it was pretty close. Because you got to be careful about that. 